Hey, it's Jackie and welcome back to my channel for the love of dogs. Uh, I'm going to kick off uh, all the breeds lists uh, with the toy group. Uh, so today I'm going to be talking about the Affin Pincher. I'm just going to go from A to Z um, in the order of all the breeds for the toy group. The Affin Pincher was first recognized by AKC in 1936, but there's artwork of Affin Pinchers as far back as the 15th century. Uh, they were originally bred as ratters uh, for barns and stables, and then they eventually worked their way up into kitchens to get mice out of kitchens. Just keep all that in mind um, if you have hamsters, gerbils, lizards, any small animals, uh, to just keep an eye on them and make sure they don't hurt or injure your beloved pet um, because that's what they were bred to do. But something to look out for when you're looking at the sires and dams of the puppies, uh, make sure they're square. So the, it's, they're square. <laughs> uh, they're only nine and a half to 11 and a half inches tall uh, and about seven to 10 pounds. So if you get a puppy and your puppy is enormous, um, unfortunately, that's not a very good breeder and that dog is not a purebred Evan Pincher. Uh, so that's why it's always very important to look at the breeders and, you know, see if they are registered through AKC, if they have competed, um, any titles that they have, uh, and make sure you can see the parents. Never ever get a dog that from somebody who they won't let you see the parents or go see their house or anything. Uh, and they should always ask you a questionnaire of everything you do, if you have a fenced in yard, um, if you can afford a puppy, all sorts of questions that a breeder should be asking you. And if they are not doing this, then do not get a dog from that breeder, please. <laughs> um, most likely that is a backyard breeder who is just breeding so many dogs together, they don't even know what breed it is anymore, honestly. Then the Affin Pinchers became extremely popular in France and were um, nicknamed the Little Mustache Devils. <laughs> um, and they're very eager to please, very sweet, loving little dogs, but they do need a lot of socialization. So get them out there as soon as their puppies, you know, get their first shots and everything. And get them out to see people and see other dogs and everything so that you don't have issues down the line once they get older and realize, oh my gosh, I have a dog who doesn't like other dogs or is afraid of people, uh, and that can create a lot of problems. <laughs> um, and you wanna start their grooming as early as you possibly can. Um, start weekly brushing and combing, uh, and you want to get these types of dogs hand-stripped. Uh, I tell customers all the time um, for double-coated dogs and wire dogs and everything, you do not want to clipper these dogs. Uh, you just do their sanitary area um, with clippers, uh, but you want to hand strip them uh, so you don't damage their coat and create all sorts of skin problems down the line. Um, they have a very easy haircut, um, but hand stripping is a little bit more expensive than regular grooming um, with clippers. So you'll want to find a groomer in your area. Um, who can hand strip or there's a lot of Facebook groups and stuff for hand stripping where you can try and teach yourself how to do it and get the tools online. Uh, just make sure you know how to, you're properly doing it. Try and avoid any grocery store uh, brands of dog food. Most of those don't have very good ingredients in it because um, you don't want to add any extra weight to a breathing challenge dog or really any dog should not be overweight. Um, but so that's pretty much it. Uh, about an Affin Pincher, um, and I'm uh, getting all of my information from the AKC book of all the dog breeds uh, and just all of the information that they have on there. And I hope you enjoyed my first video of uh, all the dog breeds, um, and if you wouldn't mind, uh, like and subscribe, and I will be continuing on. I believe the next one I will be doing is a Brussels Griffon, so stay tuned for that.